Florence where history walks. Florence. This isn't just another Italian city, it's a living museum, a testament to the power of art, culture, and the enduring spirit of the human soul. Every corner you turn in Florence whispers tales of legendary artists, powerful Medicis, and a legacy that shaped the Western world. So pack your walking shoes, grab a gelato, and let's lose ourselves in the magic that is Florence. Street musicians serenade passers-by, their melodies blending with the laughter of children chasing pigeons in the piazzas. The scent of freshly baked bread wafts from charming bakeries, tempting you to indulge in the simple pleasures of life. Florence is a sensory feast, an experience that will stay with you long after you've said arrived there to. This is the birthplace of the Renaissance, where giants like Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo and Botticelli breathed life into their masterpieces. So, are you ready to embark on an unforgettable Florentine adventure? Let's step back in time together and discover the hidden gems, the iconic landmarks, and the undeniable charm that makes Florence an absolute must-see. The Duomo, a symphony in marble. No trip to Florence is complete without paying homage to its architectural crown jewel. The Duomo, officially known as the Cattedrale di Santa Maria del Fiore. This magnificent cathedral with its iconic dome piercing the heavens is a testament to the ambition, artistry, and unwavering faith of the Florentine people. The facade, a masterpiece of Italian Gothic architecture, is a symphony in pink, green, and white marble. Step inside, and you'll be enveloped by a sense of tranquility and awe. The vastness of the interior, bathed in soft light filtering through stained glass windows, is both humbling and inspiring. Climbing to the top of the dome is a must-do, rewarding you with breathtaking panoramic views of Florence. As you stand atop this iconic landmark, gazing out over the city's terracotta rooftops, you'll feel an overwhelming sense of accomplishment and wonder. The Duomo is more than just a building. It's a symbol of human ingenuity, a testament to the power of dreams, and a reminder that anything is possible with enough passion and perseverance. Baptistry Doors Gates of Paradise Just steps away from the Duomo stands another Florentine treasure, the Baptistry of San Giovanni. While the Baptistry's exterior is impressive, it's the eastern doors, known as the Gates of Paradise, that draw visitors from around the globe. These magnificent bronze doors, created by Lorenzo Ghiberti in the 15th century, are considered one of the greatest artistic achievements of the Renaissance. Each panel depicts a scene from the Old Testament, brought to life with astonishing detail and realism. Ghiberti spent over two decades perfecting his masterpiece, pushing the boundaries of bronze casting and revolutionizing the art of sculpture. No visit to Florence is complete without experiencing the awe-inspiring beauty of Ghiberti's masterpiece. Climbing Giotto's Campanile, a bird's eye view. Adjacent to the Duomo stands another architectural marvel, Giotto's Campanile, a towering bell tower that offers unparalleled views of Florence. While the climb to the top might seem daunting, the reward is well worth the effort. Designed by the renowned painter and architect Giotto di Bondone, the Campanile is a masterpiece of Gothic architecture, adorned with colorful marble inlays and intricate sculptures. As you climb higher, the city of Florence unfolds beneath you like a Renaissance tapestry. From the top, the panoramic views are simply breathtaking. You'll see the Arno River winding its way through the heart of the city, the Ponte Vecchio standing proudly, and the terracotta rooftops stretching out as far as the eye can see. Climbing Giotto's Campanile is an experience that will stay with you long after you've returned to ground level. Section 5. Piazza della Signoria, the city's beating heart. No trip to Florence is complete without experiencing the vibrant energy of Piazza della Signoria, the city's political and social heart. This L-shaped piazza is a bustling hub of activity, home to impressive sculptures, historic buildings, and a palpable sense of history. Dominating the piazza is the imposing Palazzo Vecchio, Florence's town hall, a fortress-like structure that speaks to the city's turbulent past. In front of the Palazzo Vecchio stands a replica of Michelangelo's iconic David, a symbol of Florentine strength and resilience. As you stroll through the piazza, you'll encounter other notable sculptures, each with its own story to tell. Piazza della Signoria is a feast for the senses, a place where history comes to life. This is Florence at its most vibrant, a testament to the city's enduring spirit and cultural significance. Section 6, Uffizi Gallery, a Renaissance masterpiece. Prepare to be dazzled as you step inside the hallowed halls of the Uffizi Gallery, 
one of the world's oldest and most renowned art museums. Home to an unparalleled collection of Renaissance masterpieces, the Uffizi is a must-visit for art lovers and history buffs alike. From Botticelli's ethereal Venus to Leonardo da Vinci's enigmatic Annunciation, the Uffizi offers a glimpse into the creative genius that flourished during the Italian Renaissance. The Uffizi's collection is a who's who of Renaissance masters, with works by Michelangelo, Raphael, Titian, and Caravaggio. Be sure to spend some time admiring Botticelli's iconic Birth of Venus and Primavera, masterpieces that capture the spirit of the Renaissance. The Uffizi also houses an impressive collection of sculptures, including masterpieces by Donatello and Michelangelo. A visit to the Uffizi is an immersive experience, a chance to lose yourself in the beauty and brilliance of some of the world's greatest artistic treasures. Section 7. Ponte Vecchio. A Bridge of Dreams. No trip to Florence is complete without a leisurely stroll across the Ponte Vecchio, the city's oldest and most iconic bridge. Spanning the Arno River at its narrowest point, the Ponte Vecchio is a testament to Florentine ingenuity and resilience. But what truly sets this bridge apart is its unique charm, its whimsical shops clinging precariously to its sides, and the romantic atmosphere that pervades its every stone. Today, the bridge is a haven for jewelry shops, art galleries, and souvenir vendors, creating a vibrant and eclectic atmosphere. As you stroll across the bridge, be sure to pause at the center and admire the views both upstream and downstream. Legend has it that couples who kiss beneath the central arch of the Ponte Vecchio at sunset will experience eternal love. Whether you're a hopeless romantic or simply appreciate a good view, the Ponte Vecchio is a must-visit destination in Florence. Section 8. Boboli Gardens, a Renaissance Escape. Escape the hustle and bustle of the city and step into a tranquil oasis of Renaissance splendor at the Boboli Gardens, located just behind the Pitti Palace. These sprawling gardens, a masterpiece of Italian garden design, offer a welcome respite from the crowds, a chance to reconnect with nature, and a glimpse into the lavish lifestyles of the Medici family. As you wander through the garden's meticulously manicured paths, you'll be transported back to the 16th century, surrounded by fountain sculptures and hidden grottos. Discover hidden grottos adorned with intricate mosaics and sculptures, stumble upon secret gardens tucked away behind towering hedges, and marvel at the panoramic views of Florence from the garden's highest points. The gardens are home to a variety of sculptures, both ancient Roman and Renaissance, each adding to the park's artistic and historical significance. The Boboli Gardens are a perfect example of the Italian garden as an outdoor room, a place for contemplation, conversation, and enjoyment of the arts. Lose yourself in the beauty of nature, admire the artistry of Renaissance garden design, and enjoy a welcome respite from the city's vibrant energy. Section 9. Savoring Florentine Cuisine. A feast for the senses. No trip to Florence is complete without indulging in the city's culinary delights. Florentine cuisine is a celebration of fresh seasonal ingredients, simple preparations, and bold flavors. From hearty meat dishes to delicate pastries, Florence offers a culinary adventure for every palate. For a taste of traditional Florentine cuisine, try the Bistecca alla Fiorentina, a thick, juicy T-bone steak grilled to perfection over charcoal. Another must-try is Papa al Pomodoro, a hearty tomato and bread soup bursting with flavor. No trip to Florence is complete without sampling the city's world-renowned gelato. From classic flavors like pistachio and hazelnut to more adventurous options like lavender and ricotta with figs, there's a gelato flavor for every taste bud. So come hungry, be adventurous, and savor the flavors of Florence. Section 10. Why Florence Will Steal Your Heart Florence is more than just a city. It's an experience, a symphony for the senses, a journey through time and beauty. From the moment you step onto its cobblestone streets, you'll be captivated by its charm, its history whispering from every corner, its art beckoning you to explore. Florence will steal your heart with its undeniable beauty, its vibrant energy, and its ability to transport you to another time and place. Walking through Florence is like stepping into a living museum. The city's compact size makes it easily explored on foot, allowing you to soak up the atmosphere, discover hidden gems, and stumble upon unexpected treasures. Every corner you turn reveals a new masterpiece, a breathtaking view, or a charming cafe beckoning you to linger. So, what are you waiting for? Book your ticket, pack your bags, and prepare to fall in love with a city that will capture your heart and leave you forever changed.